We've got some very exciting news. The Sully County Library has begun a phased reopening. Jeff Bidos from the County Library joins us to talk about how this process will work. Good morning, Jeff. Jeff, can you hear me? Yeah, good morning. How are you? Okay, good. Walk me through the changes. How are you guys reopening? Uh, yeah, so like so many places, we're going to do a phased reopening, and we just started the um, first phase of that today, which is our curbside holds, and um, our patrons can now go online, and they can make a hold like they would normally make, and after that, they'll get an email, and um, they can set an appointment to come and pick up their books, which is making so many people happy, and um, if they don't want to do it through the um through the email process, if that's weird for whatever reason, you can just go to the countylibrary.org and it's right there on the home screen. Nice. Okay, perfect. This is, uh, yeah, like you said, really exciting. We're all like, we've used the books in our houses by now. We need some new ones. <laughs> yeah, totally. <laughs> yeah, people are, people are pumped. Yeah, yeah. So if somebody doesn't have a library card at this point and they still want to check out books, can they register for one on the, on the website? Yeah, you can still do that online. Um, just go to the countylibrary.org and go to the e-card page once you get there. And it's easy registration. You'll register, then call customer service. They'll get you set up. And you can place your holds online just like you could with a normal library card and everything will be good to go. You can use all of our online resources as well. Okay. And then turning our books back in, do we need to like disinfect them anyway? Anything <laughs> special? Yeah, we have, we've had some interesting questions about that. Um, we're asking the people not disinfect them just yet. Um, we'll go ahead and take care of that. When the books come in, they have to sit in the quarantine anyway. So there's no reason to disinfect the books. Um, just to be safe, we let them sit for a few days before we check them back in. And um, then when they go back out, everything should be fine. Okay, got it. So they have to sit in quarantine for three days. That's pretty funny, but quarantine. Yeah. Um, so, I mean, it sounds like you guys are probably getting a lot of holds at this point. A lot of the maybe more popular books are taken. Are there? Do you guys have like suggestions online? Sometimes it's hard to pick what you want. Yeah, we do. We do that every Thursday. Um, and we'll randomly throw some stuff up on Instagram and Facebook as well. But um, every Thursday we have a program called Novel Thoughts and that happens between four and six. And during Novel Thoughts, uh, or sorry, between three and five. And, and on Novel Thoughts, we do have a librarian who's live um, on all of our social media channels. And um, the librarians will pick a book based on books that you like. So that's a nice program that people really like. Oh, awesome. So you can tell the librarian I liked X, Y, and Z and they'll give you some suggestions. Yeah, yeah cool. exactly. It's really fun. Librarians are so good that way. They just have all of these I ideas. I know, they and know suggestions. exactly what we like to read. It's like it's their job or something. <laughs> I know, I know, yeah, they're great. <laughs> so the county library still has a lot of online things going on your guys' social media platforms as well. Are there any of those that you want to highlight? Um, yeah, um, we've been doing a ton of escape rooms. I think people really, really like escape rooms. Um, I don't know if they're trying to escape the fact that so many of them <laughs> were stuck in the house. Yep, that um, sounds but like these, it. These rooms are really fun, and we actually did a we did a mixtape the other day on Spotify, which is new for us. Awesome, cool. So some Spotify content there, and this yeah. this curbside pickup, not just books, right? You've got like DVDs and all kinds of things, CDs. Yeah, yeah, you can pick up your DVDs, your CDs as well if you want mm -hmm. that great quality sound of the CD um, and books as well. All right, Jeff Bidos from the County Library. Thanks so much for this information. We'll have it on our website too, abc4.com/jmu. Thanks, Jeff. Okay, thank you.